with that. Yeah, that was fun. That's just Did saying that. Yeah, just well, I don't know nothing about cameras. Into the SD card. Okay. All right. It's good. So today, guys, uh, we had a little technical difficulty when we got that resolved. Uh, today, on our adventure, we have came across Brushy Mountain State Penitentiary. Uh, it's a very historical prison. Uh, one of the inmates that I didn't notice that was housed here or incarcerated here uh, was actually the assassinate. The uh, it was Martin Luther King's assassination. Uh, he was incarcerated here um, up until his time of death. Uh, so that's pretty interesting fact. Uh, there, it's been known to have a lot of famous criminals here. Um, so we're going to take a tour inside. I do have my K2 meter. I'm willing to try it out and see if I can get any kind of readings. Um, but there is a building behind me uh, that looks abandoned. We're going to try to see if we can look inside the window. Uh, right before you get to the prison, though, there is a gift shop. I strongly recommend it. Check out the new hat. It's a great hat. Uh, it doesn't cost much. Uh, there's also a distil distillery down there that you can try five different moonshines. Five dollars, can't beat it. Um, great place, wonderful people, very friendly. Um, but with that being said, let's go ahead and start our journey into this prison. I know it's kind of ironic. Most time people try to get out of prison, we're trying to get into a prison. So let's go ahead and start this journey. Um, but make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. And I love everyone that has been subscribing to my channel and hitting those likes and hitting those comments i appreciate it let's keep going let's try to get me up to 20 20 20 subscribers i'm at 11 now so let's go ahead and keep bumping that up um with that being said let's go ahead and start our journey and i love you guys i told you i wonder what this building was no not really what, what is really crazy though they that scared straight moonshine was 110 for me. That's crazy. Everything else was like. It, it, it helped. It's like cough medicine. Like, like even wow. Like sip of it, that is. It helps your throat. Especially when you're out here. You can't even see it. You can't breathe. Look at that right there, babe. That is it. What is this? What is this thing? I don't know. I, don't, I have no idea what this is. Probably like a guard tower, I would assume. Yeah, look, they got the candles up there. Yeah. Cause that is a watchtower. We can't go over there. That's behind it. Uh, I don't know, baby. <laughs> not, <clears throat> not really. Well, what's over here? So here's the tour entrance. So I'm assuming that you get out at that opening down there. You know? I'm assuming that you come out there. Yeah, you come out there. See how those people are coming out? You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, I was just uh, I'm pretty sure they didn't. I'm pretty sure they didn't jump out of those. Well, you got to think, babe. Look at this. I mean, those walls don't seem high, but that's like three layers of razor wire. You know? But like, like if if you really think about it, those wires right there are so sharp that they can actually cut right through butter. All right. Um, no, not really. Hey there, welcome to Russian Mountain State Penitentiary. I can take your tickets. He's in your pocket. We can go that way. We just go in here real quick. Okay, come on. It was, I think it was my light was turned on. You gotta turn it on when you go inside. I don't know what I've done. I got so sick. I'm gonna get some pictures for you too. But I've done, they done let everybody go. I know already on overtime. Agree to work over. Wow, look at this. Oh, that one. 
This is the D block. Can you see inside? Here. Okay. D block. This how small it is? D block was for the highly big dangerous inmates. This? Yes. Like the murderers and stuff. Golly. Look, buddy. Yeah, come check this out. This is sales. There's sales up here, too. Well, let's check this hall out. Oh, this is the shower. Ew. Please, though, buddy, do not, do not want to see your naked booties. No, these are showers. Or the, no, down there was a shower. This is a cell. Is it? Yeah, because see, there's the toilet. And this what they say? Yeah, this, how, this is basically. Look, see this thing right here? See this thing right here? See this thing right here? This is where they slide their food in. I'm getting a really bad smell in here. <coughs> it ain't as bad as that other. No. Last night was horrifying. That was really bad. Look at this small walkthrough. Huh? Golly, look at this walkthrough. So small and tight. <laughs> <laughs> Hope he ain't fat getting under here. <laughs> Is this the one you said? Hey, look, somebody had a Dale Earnhardt. Oh, cool. Dale Earnhardt person. Need a little bit of money. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, 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 Oh my god, baby, come here. Look at this. This thing was just spiking just a second ago. Touch it. If there's any spirits here, make my K2 go, go off. I actually like it here. <laughs> <laughs> Let me hold that. I don't want to do it again. No. I don't want anything to get attached to you, babe. Oh, ain't nothing going to get no attached to nothing. I don't think. Hey, no, I'm trusting me. I don't guarantee a lot of inmates probably want to, want to choke too, babe. Yeah. Just because they're inmates, don't mean they're bad people. No, I'm just saying that they probably went to church after being stuck in here. Hopefully they clean their bathrooms a lot, because that's really dirty. <laughs> that's a lot of decay. The paint filling. Sure, your mamas would not be liking this dirty bathroom. <laughs> oh, look, baby. It's going off a second ago. Yeah. Yeah. It could be just uh, the bars. It's not the bars, look. The, the metal doesn't set And not even my camera. I love it. <laughs> oh, it's a nice metal box, isn't that cool? 
<laughs> Weird place to get mail. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I want to get mail in here. No, no, I'm pretty sure I do not. Um, I'm 100% positive I want to get mail here. <laughs> I think we already pretty much did this one. Yeah, I know. We gotta go outside. Yeah, we gotta go back through this way. Because that was the entrance of the D block. That is a big mailbox. I took a picture of it. Commissary. <laughs> I guess that's when they have like suggestions, I guess. There we're going in that building. <laughs> Whoa. What's Scary. That is a shower. That is creepy. Wow, look at the bunks. I think that's the holding cell. Really? Yeah. right there. Bahala? Bahala. What does that mean? I, I don't know. Wish I can, wish I can walk in front of them. There's still toilet paper in here. <laughs> I gotta roll the toilet paper in here, babe. Looks like somebody's trying to make a hole right here to escape. Babe? I'm 19. Look. Right there. What's with the star? Look at it. Look right there on the floor. I guess so. Can you go upstairs? I'm right in here. Oh my goodness. Wow. 
I can probably see that. What do you think of this place? <laughs> it's actually kind of... Somebody went inside the cell. Huh? This is cell 20 right here. I don't know. Somebody went inside though, because look, they had a ticket. How'd they get in there? Oh, it's probably from the tour. Really? Yeah. You have to pay for it? Uh, yeah. A little bit more money. So, 20? 21? I think it's around 22. Look, I'm in the shower. I hope I don't drop the soap. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Baby, I I'll have to I'll have to Google, but I mean that's what really drew me. But Mr. King, King, Martin Luther King's I know. said that he that his son tried to say that that guy didn't do it. Well, he had a racial hostile shooting because of a racial tension. This is it's cold up here. That was a dark floor, but... Yeah, okay. <laughs> that was the place in the evening. We're gonna go there in a second. No, I've been getting a few things off the cage here. No, well, I mean... That's kind of creepy down there, look at that. <laughs> It's pretty cool though. I'm actually kind of glad I went here. Small door to get your food. Pretty cool though. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Do you like it? Yeah. Oh, the cafeteria? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's where they said that most of the time when people do paranormal investigations at night, that's where it's actually the most haunted. Can we go outside when you try to jump the fence and stuff too out there in the very back? We're gonna make that way, baby. We're we gotta go up to the third floor. I I'm still trying to figure out how you would climb that concrete wall. He tried to lower that there, but there's a I bet he got like I bet he was like I'm sure you can. Claw marks or something on the wall? No, scruff marks or something. Savannah. <laughs> <That's funny. laughs> huh, Savannah's been here. April, Savannah, Hannah. Wow. Savannah's been here. Listen to you. <laughs> <laughs> so she has. <laughs> Freaking. Look at that. You know that it's like. Like. Old oh, because like the paint's peeling. Yeah. Oh man, I can't wait to upload this video. Huh? There's um, there's a lot happening right here. Mm -hmm. I know. A lot 
It was, it was blood. I was just let happen. Is there anything here with us today? Sorry to hear about that racial tension that you guys had. Nothing. If you're here with me, give me a sign. Maybe it went off a little bit. It's nothing. You want to go to the chat hall? Can I hold it? <laughs> Can I hold it? Why? Okay. Look at that big door. Ah, that's gotta be a thick door. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah. Is there anything here with us? I'm gonna take these animal things. Yeah. The Great Escape Guru. Oh, they must take these off. Take these out when they do paranormal investigations at night because we never see these in the video. Take what out? Move these at night. Really? Yeah, because you remember when we watched Omar's video? These were not not in his video when he came. That other guy I watched the other day, they were sitting for hours waiting right there. Waiting. And nothing. From what I see right here would be. Where Omar had that experience with the chairs was right here. Yeah. Um, I like the little animal prints though. Murder and mayhem. Oh, there, that's why this place is so like haunted. In the cafeteria? Because there was like a murder here. Do you want Kitchen. That is neat. That's the kitchen right here. What? I know. It's going off now. I seen it. Don't put the light on it. I'm gonna do that because it's in the I'm getting a reading on the K2 meter. Um I figured out that the cafeteria is the most haunted part of the prison. It's because there were several murders that actually took place in the cafeteria uh, during the time of this prison being open. Um, so that is actually a pretty scary fact and information. Um, but as you can see, we're looking right here, uh, inside this little wall right here is where they made the food. 
and was serving to the inmates. They would come right here to this metal tray looking line thing and this is where they would get their food and then they would go over here and sit with their meals. That is a really creepy looking kitchen. I'm gonna go inside. <laughs> I'm gonna go inside. Yeah, they have a lot of neat artwork around here. Hey, babe. You ready to walk down this way? This creepy tunnel? Yeah. It's really cold in here. Huh? I'm right here, sweetheart. I was reading that information about the cafeteria. Yeah. What? You caught something? Hold on. Tell me. Is there any spirits with us? If so, make my K2 meter spike to red, yellow, or orange. Or give us a sign that you are here. Give us a tap or even a knock. We know you're here. We see you on the camera. We know you haunt these halls and we want to communicate with you. Don't be shy. Are you shy or are you scared to give us a sign? We're sorry that if you were harmed in this prison, we are just here to communicate with you and get your side of the story. Can you give me a sign? Look inside that door right there. You see that door with a dark wall? Yeah. What is that? I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Isn't it crazy? There is something in there. I swear I just seen a shadow figure. Okay. 
K2 meter just went off too. Something is here. So yeah, somebody. Something there. I want to bring it to the other side. You think so? I don't know, but I've just seen something inside that one. And my camera just got blurry too. I got already, look, I got 12 minutes on that last one and now 14 on this one. It's going to be a long video. See, murder and, yeah, murder and mayhem. <laughs> really? You gotta go that far? Yeah. I mean, if it's a, oh, hey, look at this bear. Well, at least they had some artwork. <laughs> I wonder if I have some gift cake. Oh, wow. Hey, if you need hand sanitizer, there's a disposable right here. Hey. Yeah, right here. There's a visitor center right here, family visiting. Where families would visit. Okay. So we've been on the other side. That's where we came in. This is actually pretty cool. Hey, baby, if you want to see inside here, go ahead. No, look. Oh, wow. Camera works. Light works. Hey, look, adult education. It's like the... Hey babe, can you take a picture of me standing next to this gate? Start filming again. Non contact visitation. Why didn't we know when they did that? I don't know. That is creepy. Hey, look. Look, family visitation right here. No, really. Why did they do non contact visitation? Because they're strong criminals, baby. Nineteen. Oh wow, look at this. In 1972, they closed the prison because the guards went on a protest um, for unsafe working conditions. And then they reopened it in 1976 after they increased the security measures and made it, safe, made it safer for them. Well, I mean, it goes to say that, I mean, if you have guards that are watching over inmates, you want to make sure that they feel safe and comfortable yeah. while they're doing the job. Did it take a long time to No. <laughs> no, no it did not. It's really cold right here. 
It's like a strong like. Oh, if you need hand sanitizer, that works. Look at. Dead drop. A long way down. Oh, that's that thing that you talked about. Yeah. When they pushed them off. Yeah, that's where the yeah. They, that's where they had to sit here and put those on. Those gates. The, yeah, they pushed them over this rail. Yeah. I like these cells. I don't know why. I mean, I like the cells because they got that rust. You know what I'm saying? They got that old feel. Yeah. <laughs> It is pretty neat though. I want to go to the third floor and see how spooky that is. I, I got a few things off the gate too. Yeah. Look at this. That's such a pretty view. It's warm out here. I'm going upstairs real quick. Huh? Oh, okay. Third floor. How many floors are there? Three. Uh, no, you can't go to the third floor. Why? It says do not enter. But I think you can. That's the place you want to go. <laughs> <laughs> do not enter signs. We really want to Well, go. these floors feel not well at all. Why? Do you not? Oh, we got to get downstairs. Look. Is it? The burial and stuff. Yeah, no, that's what's out in the back. No, it just doesn't feel right, does it? Does it? Right there, right there. What? Yeah, down there. FBI is less wanted James. James Earl, that's him. Where is it? Is it down there? It's down there. Yep, yeah, let's get down there. It's down there. No, doesn't it feel like this floor kind of slants? Any famous inmates? Babe? Baby? Doesn't it feel like this floor is kind of like slanted? Yeah. <laughs> Oh wow, look at this decay. That is wick. I hey, somebody was watching TV. <laughs> oh, right, wait. <gasps> what? They didn't use that to like do anything like suicidal, did they? I think it's probably for TV, honey. Cause I don't know, because look, it's going through the vent. Or did they use that as like a tool? No. Well, where would you put the TV, though? That's right the thing. there. Look, you just put a TV right there. Baby, that's the vent to go into the pipes. <laughs> Look at that mirror right there, how rusted it is. Oh, well, I'm crazy, and I think about stuff like that. Well, I mean, you got to think about it. I don't know, though. There's some more of it right there. Could be cameras. No, oh, you won't. There's a staircase over this way. It's a prison. They got entrances they from both. You can't go up to the third floor. You can't go to the first floor? Third floor. So the third floor is closed off. That's up. Let's go. That sucks that the third floor is closed. I think that's what I was reading. There was like one part of the prison that was um, blocked off from like tours and stuff. Even Omar and them couldn't even get to the floor, third floor. It's blocked off. Yeah. They wouldn't let them? No, it's like severely um, bad up there. Like. The flooring is, um, no, it's like almost collapsing or something. Well, you gotta think, this is prison life. I don't really see this as being a life. See, oh wow, babe, look at this. That museum? I don't know, but we're gonna go to find it. I don't want to listen to the video, but I do want to see the museum. You know? Oh, they had a farm on here too. Geronimo.
Oh, wow, well, look. Baby. Baby. Look, you remember that uh, thing? Have you ever heard about Geronimo? Geronimo? That was actually the Russian Mountains pet towards Geronimo, a wild baby frown found by a guard after it fell from a ledge into the yard. Huh. And it ended Geronimo. <laughs> I see that. I, I, oh, I got the last one up there too. The oh, look, and famous inmates accused serial killers like Bruce Mannon and Thomas Zuman. Oh wow, Minden is a long haul trucker from Indiana who was, was known for preying on redhead prostitutes at truck stops. Okay, I'm gonna have to Google that later. No, I mean, I'm Googling it, like I wanna find out more information on him because I'm sick. I think it's interesting though, but what did what did Zoom Man Husky do? Was convicted of kidnapping 56 years in prison? Claiming insanity for multiple Whoa, personality whoa. Disorder. Oh, that's why they called him Zoom Man. He's claiming insanity for multiple personality Yeah, but look look at this, look at this. He, they were, they named him Zoom Man because he, he, Knoxville Zoo. Yeah, he, he dumped four prostitutes' bodies near the Zox, Knoxville. Yeah, he worked in the. That's kind of creepy. <laughs> creepy and sad at the same time. Here's yours. There you go, baby. Phone just stopped. Really? No, it didn't just stop. I had a lot of battery in this phone too. Spirits are down to it. It just died. Did it, did it die? No, it what? It was charged though that when we left the hotel. I know. It just shut off. Hey. Can you take a picture of that? What? That James Earl thing? Look, guess whose cell that is. James Earl. This is his cell. Hey, babe, there was something latched on to that camera or the phone. The spirits can kill your. Spirits can take over your shit. They really can. I'm surprised my camera's still doing well. Yeah, I'm down to one bad right now. Are you really? Yeah. Oh, this is the museum. Yeah. See? I have that on my phone. It turned it off. It didn't kill it, it just turned it off. Look at this, babe. These are actual pieces that was in the prison. 
Like the leg arms? Oh, they had a gang in here. Look, they had a gang in here. Outlaw Brotherhood. The skull and the ring. Huh? Prison made ring. That's pretty cool. Hey, look at this inmate card. That's what they got when they got in here. They had to keep them in a gymnasium because they're overflowed. Yeah. Seriously? Yeah. It's not really being isolated and being locked up, is it? No, not really. <laughs> Pretty much might as well just get away from them. Oh, here's some of the stuff that they used in the kitchen. Hey, look at that plaque. Employees who have passed away during service with the state of Tennessee, Brush Mountain State Penitentiary. I think they died here. Employees? Yep. I think that's what that is. Hey, look at the shackles. Oh, look at this old taser, babe. Oh, they have a book on him. Some of the famous books. Breaking the Chains, A Survivor's Journey. Pretty neat though. What do you think, babe? Oh, look, babe. They had the old correctional flag over there. Yeah. Look, officer badges used over the years. Oh, they had, somebody had a brass knuckles in there?
What's in here? It's a hole. What's a hole? What was that mean? A hole is where really bad inmates went. Wow, look at this. Hold on, baby. This is the wreck area, I guess. You gonna go buy basketball? Gymnasium? Oh boy. That was another thing that was really haunted. The gymnasium. Is the phone back on? Yeah, that's weird. It just like popped. It came, it, it came back on when I went into the uh, museum. <laughs> and then it just shut off completely when I was in there. Like right over there. Oh the my gosh. That's when it shut off. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you want to try to make some spirits man? That's it. <laughs> This is the gymnasium, huh? It's a big gymnasium. But what are they exactly doing here? Because outside was the basketball court. Alright. Maybe. <laughs> is there a spirit attached to this chair? Oh, this is probably where they hold the concert at in here. Yeah. In here or outside. Because you know at the end of the month they have a concert coming up. That is creepy looking. What is that? Oh, let's go look. There it is. That's that spot where you tried to jump. Right over there in that corner down there. See over there against yeah. the wall? That's where he tried to jump and escape, but it wasn't going to happen. They caught him. Right off the you back. can't go in there. They showed pictures of him catching him. Him and seven, seven other guys were trying to jump that, jump that, um, that wall right there. Yeah, this is where probably where they hold the concert. Because there's concessions and all that. Yeah. No, I hear you, baby. No, it's right here, look. Where, right there in that building? Yeah, because see all the lights up there on the top? That's where they'd have the concert and have a big old feeling of it. I bet you. You can tell it's a stage. Yeah. It's just like a stage. I don't know why you would have a concert in a prison, but hey. 
I mean, probably. Yeah, I remember what jumped in the car. They're getting ready for a concert. They got a concert coming up at the end of the month. I jumped about with my car. Yeah, they got a concert at the end of the month. At the end of the month, who is it? Uh, I think it was Trace Atkins coming up here. Is that that wall you're talking about? Yeah. Well, I mean, there's a tower right there, so I mean. Yeah. Well, I mean, also, if you really think about it, they really weren't smart because there's a guard tower right there. Yeah. You want to walk with me? Yeah. We'll, we'll walk together over this, this, uh, this wall. I'll I mean, it's. Of it. I kind of like the property, though. What time is it? One o'clock. Really? Yeah. No, it is itching so bad right there. Your your camera's going blurry too, right now. Yeah. That has some just died right there by that James Earl. Is it saying James Earl? James Earl. Right there next to his stall right there. My phone died out. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? And I turned it back on the museum, it still has some battery. It has like 20 something percent. My question is, is when he jumped this wall? He tried to. Where he was he gonna to go? Cause there's nothing on the other side. Anywhere, I guess. What? Why does it keep shutting down? I wanted to take a picture of that. What? Of this area, this is exactly where the place you to jump at. Hold on. Is there something that's connected inside this prison that makes it big? Oh, that's a beautiful view. Look at that in the background. Mm -hmm. Oh, This is uh, probably something attached to it. You know that spirits feed off battery and electronics. Baby, everything crazy happened here. Everything. Hey, come check this hole out. Are you all right, babe? Uh, you're just crashed down, so I didn't know if you were okay. Are you thirsty? Water over here. Huh? There's some water over here. Uh, well, I mean, I mean, it's not a five-star resort, but maybe, maybe a two-star. That's it. Here's the thing, babe. Everywhere we go, we get dirty. 
Well, oh, good. Now you have something to do tomorrow. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, my mom's like, what time do you think you guys are going to be back? The, the get can get. I was like, I, I don't know. It's like, it's like two hours here and two hours there. and This is neat. Concert. They already have the concert? No, it's at the end of the month. Oh yeah, somebody tried to get it knocked down. Look, there's bomb wire that's hanging. Yeah. See it? Yeah. Look at these big cameras. Oh boy. This is one of those places that you're not allowed to go to or go inside. Why? 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 I think it's because it's like severely falling down. That's why. What is it? Look in here. What is it? C block. Why can't we go in there? Roof is falling, baby. Oh. See that? All those water spots on the top. Something's attached. Who hit that? That's from the inside. What? You oh wow, are you serious? Yeah, the inmate did that. That's funny. Touch that. No. No, touch it. Just, I, I can't do that. Okay, then just be afraid. Okay, fine, I'll touch it. Okay, touch it. See how it's on the inside? Wow. Oh yeah, this one's bad too. Come and look at this one. Is there a spirit here? Knock on the window if you are here. Yeah, it's that one block that they have. Where is it? Oh, they probably got. What was in here? Uh, another block. Another cell block. For inmates? Yeah, see how bad the roof is? They used to stay in this? Yeah, I think it was the minimum security. Like, the inmates that weren't. Uh, as dangerous as the ones that we went through. <laughs> yeah. Kind of like the good guys. I have no idea what you just said. A little mini thing here and there. Probably like petty theft and small things. And then down there where we were able to tour sales were the murderers. Really? Yep. Then if you go down here at the warden table, you can actually eat. They have a restaurant. Do you want to go eat? Let's go. Let's go. With the warden? Yeah, let's go. Let's go with the warden. I'm not going to. I'm not going to record me eating. <laughs> huh? I'm not going to record myself eating. I'm pretty sure my fans will be happy with my. <laughs> the footage that I have here and also at the Higdon Hotel. So I'm not going to film myself eating. Yeah, that's close, but I can still stand on top. That's pretty cool though.
you do? Yeah. Why not? Baby, I am so excited about being here. I want to stay in here. I want to. I want to be able to sleep in James Earl's cell. I'm gonna message uh, Omar and tell him that he should next time he comes out here, if he ever comes back out, do a spirit box in James Earl's um, cell 28 where James Earl stayed. Do a spirit box. Do a spirit box and see if he can communicate with James Earl. Yeah. To get the uh, truth. The truth. Yep. It's all about the truth. This place closes at seven. Yeah. Right before it gets dark. Yep. It's really the ground's really saturated. You ever notice that? It's a little squishy. <laughs> I kind of, I'm, it's, it's a, I'm gonna have a long video. I can tell you that. Yeah. What is this? Oh, um, that's where they kept the very, very serious inmates. Really? Like the really, yeah. Cause I watched some guy's video and they came here and it was like. Like the like the mass murders yeah, and stuff. Yeah, like the really severe, severe. Like this is where they kept them right here. They had their own little cage. That's kind of sad because what happens? I think. What happens if it gets cold? We can go in here. There's a way to get in here. Isn't it? That would be kind of sad. What happens if it gets cold? Cage, Let me get this real quick. Oh, uh, let me get this real quick. The guard tower. Let them play. Yeah. <laughs> what are they, kids? Like, yeah. We're gonna let you out and play. <laughs> so this is where they kept. This is solitary. Yeah, right here. This is where they went. That's what I here. They used to keep them. And they let them over here and let them play in the yard. Okay, they were kept in this. Right here. Right back there. Yeah, we went in there. Yeah, so they would let them out right here through this door. The really, really bad guys right here, and they'd let them in here, and they each one had to go in here and do their thing. That guy got this open somehow in that video. I don't know how he did it, but he did it. I don't know. I think it, you know, it's this one. Go ahead, Bane. Go inside. Okay, go inside and take a picture of you. Yeah, it's this one. It's open. I'm going to close this. I'm going to take a picture of you. Hurry up, come on. I'm not going to close it, close it. You are in lockdown. <laughs> You're so funny. Is is this thing? Yeah, back up a little bit. Oh, you got meaner than that. Uh, I think it's still on. I think it's still on recording mode. <laughs> oh, just hit the red button, baby. Hit the red button real quick while it's on this view. Red button. This is where they yeah, this is solitary where they, people came to hang air. out and smell the fresh air. And There's only one person in each place. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. That was weird. It just I, went off. His name is Leroy. 97. 
Leroy. That's what it says. Hello, Leroy. Are you here with me? Leroy. If there's any spirits here, make my K2 meter go off. Don't be shy. We just want to communicate with you. Can you make a noise? Close a door? Or anything in between? Anything? Are you afraid to talk? We know you're here. Did you ever talk to James Earl that used to be incarcerated here? Well, I got something. Did you know it? Yeah. It gave, it, gave, it gave me a green on the K2. He probably did talk to him. Because green means it is. He only flashed once. Well, so. That's as much as you need. That's your other taste. No, I don't know why I'm saying that. I, oh. No, it's going off. Look. Oh my god. He didn't want you to leave. What's going off? I'm getting it on the camera. What is that? Do you want us to go or do you want us to stay? Are we in your cage that you played in? What were you here for? Murder. Did you murder someone? There's two on it. They took your feet through that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Don't you do that. <laughs> Put it in my pocket for me, please. Mm -hmm. Alright, so now that we were communicating with each other, you were giving me a sign that you were here or you that you committed a murder. Is that true? I want to communicate with you. I want to get your side, your story, maybe your confession. Come on, don't be frightened. Don't be scared. Give me a sign. I know that you probably committed a murder. That's why you were in solitary. Is that correct? Hmm. So what's your name? Are you here with me? Did you have any friends in solitary? Did you commit a murder here in the state of Tennessee? Are you from an outside? You made my K2 meter spike to red earlier. What are you afraid now, Leroy? Just trying to communicate with you. That is your name, isn't it? I'm in the cell that you possibly was hanging in. It says Leroy of 97. Was that you? Or was that another inmate? What, you think he's willing to speak to me? Because are you afraid to talk to me? What about in the cafeteria? Did you ever know anybody that was in the cafeteria that was murdered? Hmm? Come on. Give me a sign. I know you're here with us. Come on, Leroy, just give me a sign that you're here on my K2 meter. You don't even have to speak. Are you afraid? Are you scared? I thought you were an inmate here. I thought you were a tough criminal. You seem like you're afraid to, to communicate with us. What about James? James Earl, was he... Was he, a, was he a tough inmate here? Did he get assaulted a lot? Do you believe that he in, and that he assassinated Martin Luther King Jr.? Huh? Martin Luther King Jr.? James Earl. I'm asking him if he knew James. Oh, there's Martin Luther King and Martin Luther King Jr. Okay. And then Martin Luther King Jr. There's no Martin Luther. This, this is like Dr. King? Yeah. He killed Dr. King? Dr. King, Martin Luther King Jr., the one that did the march. He killed him over here at the, 
the, uh, a hotel in Tennessee, you can actually pay. It actually, the hotel is actually closed now, and it's actually a historical site. No, no, I'm saying he he, he killed the father. No. Or the son. The son, baby, Doctor Martin Luther King Jr. He killed the son of Doctor Luther. The one that marched for civil rights in Alabama. He killed him. Yes. His father was dead way before then. Really? Yes. I gotta do this one. I guess my history does not well good. No, they're fading out there, baby. Well, did you get anything? Mm -hmm. I got that red earlier. These plants are really pretty. Aren't they pretty? Yeah. That's not poison ivy, is it? I probably escaped. The door's open, so it's not going to expect. It's going off here and there. But I mean, it's still kind of early, too. There's a lot of activity going on. We just got something just a few minutes ago. You don't care about me, we did it. Yeah, but sometimes you can get it. You can get something off of K2. And then go back in the next few minutes, and then be gone. Really? Yeah. I mean, he could be out here in the hall. He's ran away. He's like, the door goes out. Ah. I'm free. <laughs> I'm going to go and get me a hamburger. I mean, that one thing that guy talks about being in here, he says something about the cheeseburgers. Cheeseburgers? Is there any inmates here with us? It's flashing. Mm -hmm. no, look, it was flashing. Mm -hmm. It is, I, I mean, it's a really neat place, though. I mean, there's a lot of history here, so, I mean, I couldn't, could not even imagine how haunted it really could be. Yeah. I wonder if they turn this place into like a haunted house. Makes you wonder. Says, says, uh, something he went. He he went to he went to D block because. This is D block. Yeah, he went. No, he was cell twenty eight. Was his cell yeah. at one point? But no, I mean, yeah, that was after he was stabbed twenty two times in that cell over there. And he got fixed, and then he went into isolation. Yes. This he probably was talking to him. Maybe he had a connection more to that than itself. Maybe he had a connection more to his area right here. That would be crazy. <laughs> Do you think so? James, are you here with us? I'm going to go back to the cell. <laughs> you want to go back to that cell area? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not here, though. It's on there. Yeah. Yeah. This is the solitary. Solitary confinement. Oh, I'm not sure. Did yeah. Eyes? Getting hungry. We gotta go eat something. You wanna eat it? Eat with the warden? Yeah, we got like 160. Okay. We'll eat with the warden. Wait, uh, yeah, I believe it's in here. Down right here.
I think it's right here. Baby. No, it's on this side. No, it's on this side, I think. Now it's over here. I mean, his pictures of things are on the wall. Right. It's not in here. No, maybe it's on this side. Yeah, it's on the other side because there's that picture. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Good thing I brought that extra battery. Yeah. I never You feel you feeling a little bit better after taking the moonshine? Please don't dump that on camera. Hmm? You didn't just say that on camera, did you? Mm-hmm. It was these little scooters. Baby, it's a test test. Taste test. It's not like it's just It's part of the prison tour. I know that it's really not even that big. Whoa, what is this? We didn't see this. What is this? I hate you. <laughs> no smoking. I think this was the holding cell. Something's messing with my camera, it's just going in and out. As soon as you go back into the cell, it will be. That's pretty neat, guys. It's really cold. I mean, that's not a good thing. Yeah, it's a good thing, though. You feel like out in the middle of nowhere and you're like in scary issues. Well, I don't really know where you're at. Actually, no. The only other thing I can think of is being in there, but probably on the it's in there. It's over here. Okay, that's awesome. Please do not litter. Some Can I throw the cup on the ground? Because there's where we. It's right here. I think. No, this is a different cell that we didn't hit up. Cause see the walk. Oh, now it's got lights on. They got even lights in the back. How are they going to The special. Yeah. Hey, who's this thing? How does this young fellow look like in this guy? I don't know, but he's creepy looking. That bottom one is, yeah, he is. He's a little off looking. See if we can get a reading with the K2 meter. Is there any spirits here with us? This still can make my K2 meter go off.
Baby, come here. You want to see the thing go off or a lot? See it? Dig it. Dig it. Hold on. Oh my god, that thing just went all the way to red. <laughs> if you're here with us, make my K2 meter go to red, orange, or yellow. If you're not afraid, you'll move my K2. Do it. Do it. I got a good, I got a few readings. Did somebody die in 16? <laughs> hey, James Earl's over here. Babe, James Earl on this side. Still amazing that this is a cell. Okay. Where's the resting that mem memory or whatever? Yeah. That burial? I wonder where that's at. We're out here. That's a good thing. Oh, that looks so creepy right there. Here, I'm gonna give it to you, and I'm gonna do my my uh, outro. And then we're gonna go eat. Where's your thing at? You. I'm just, I'm, I, I haven't been able to screw it on there yet, so I'm just holding on to it real close. The red button? Yeah, it's already recording. Oh. All right, you guys, so that has concluded our tour here. Uh, as you can see, that's the prison right there. Um, unfortunately, you can't go to the third floor. It's actually blocked off. Coming here, learned a lot of things. Um, was able to view uh, James Earl's cell, which is cell 28. Um, if you guys are not familiar with who that is, that is the one that uh, was known to have assassinated uh, Martin Luther King Jr. Um, so that's pretty cool. Um, back over here, towards this little thing over there, we were able to.
take a picture of the wall that he was supposedly trying to jump over with seven other inmates. Uh, was unsuccessful. Was caught by an, uh, caught by a guard. Um, but with that being said, um, this was the end of the video. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Hit that smash button. Hit that spa smash button or smash that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Um, and then after this, we're gonna go. If you guys ever come here and want to take a tour of this place, down there at the gift shop, they do have a restaurant called the Warden um, Table. Uh, it's a fan it's a restaurant there um, on Brushy Mountain that you can stop by and get some lunch. That's what we're about to do. And then we got a long journey back uh, to Georgia, and then we're gonna pick up our daughter and head back home. I'm going to start working on editing these videos in the next couple of days. Um, also, don't forget, I do have that other video that's going to be dropping at the same time as this one, which is that video of me going to the Higdon Hotel in Tennessee, um, which is a hotel that's been there for about 150 years. So with those two contents, I'm hoping that I can get a lot of views and a lot of likes and a lot of comments. Um, I do once again want to appreciate all the recent new subscribers that have subscribed to my channel. I really do appreciate it. It means a lot. Uh, it shows how much hard work and dedication can go a long way uh, in making you know your fans happy and giving them the content that that they, that they are asking for. Uh, and that's what my job is: is to make sure that my viewers are happy with the content that I provide for them. Um, but with that being said, I love you guys, and I hope that you guys enjoy this video, uh, and I'll see you guys again.